Hi, welcome to GUI.ai. Uh, we are looking at how to use our AI animation generator. This is a very simple tool, uh, but very evocative and particularly exciting for uh, doing media related work for, and specifically for artists who might want to do some AI related explorations as well. So we just have to go to the explore section on our website and go to the very end uh, where we see an AI animation generator. So this is what it looks like. Uh, when you see the run, there's something here with the prompt. And if I hit play, it gives me a very nice zoom, zooming in kind of uh, animation thing going. Now, this is uh, a very, very, very basic tool to use currently. But I think it's a great way to start off your AI journey and also to just like explore what kind of ways you want to use uh, AI prompting in, in specifically in like animation formats. Some people like to use it with their music videos when they time the frames uh, based on the, their music. Uh, some people have been trying to explore it as uh, as backgrounds for their uh, for their uh, VJing uh, gigs, and we've also been using it in our backgrounds for our uh, wonderful bots. So here you can see that there's a animator running at the back, which is kind of slowly transitioning between some ideas of what a coral could be. So it's very simple. You define a number of frames here. We'll go with the lowest, which is 100. Uh, and then you just say that at this particular frame number, change the animation to start going in this direction or describe it in a particular way. So here at the zero frame, uh, which is the first frame, we say it's an underwater world with muted corals that look like houses with a cinematic uh, lighting glow on them with, uh, ext uh, I mean, you don't need detail faces because there's nothing here for that. And there are no bodies. So we will change this out to with three, uh, 3D realism. Now at the 50th frame, uh, which is halfway through the uh, video because we have 100 frames I want it to look more like a desert so I'm going to put a uh, divider line here I'm uncertain what it's called and then say 50 put a colon and then I have to add a new prompt here so I will say a uh, house in the desert with cactus around it with a cinematic glow light shining on it and again I'll say 3D realism render now I'm not certain what's going to happen and it's definitely not going to look like this because we changed out a little bit of the first prompt as well. So I'm going to hit submit and then wait for this to work. Uh, so this can take up to uh, maybe say like 10 to 15 minutes. Uh, I think about 600 to 900 seconds is what I've observed. So we just have to wait it out and then you'll have a very sweet looking video that you could use in your creative projects. Thank you.